Hey guys, I'm Roman. I'm Lou. And welcome back to the Bourbon Beast, where today we have another exciting episode for you guys. Lou, what do we got, man? We got the Bardstown Disco 11. Mm. Yeah, one of the bangers out of 2023, I believe. Yes. Or no, maybe even early. I don't know. When I, the I, hell I have no idea. Out, have but no idea. from what I've heard, it's one of the great bottles that came out from Bardstown. I don't remember Ooh. if we ever drank anything from Bardstown. I don't recall, but I, this is coming think, in. I don't think I have. Yeah. 118.1. Yeah. Proof. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting, interesting. And interesting. Th th this one, I think it's very good. And from what uh, whiskeys were put in there, mm -hmm. uh, sound pretty damn amazing because it's 70, 73. 73% <laughs> <laughs> 13 year whiskey. That is, there. That yeah. is up there. That, that's that is a up lot there. of whiskey given, that's from 13 years. And it's a blend, right? Yeah, it's a blend. So 73% Kentucky, 13 year, corn mm -hmm. 75%, right? 13%, malted barley 12%. We have 21% Kentucky, 10 year, mm -hmm. 78 corn, 13 rye, and malted barley 9%. Mm -hmm. And last being the 6% of Bartstown Bourbon Co. Company bourbon coming in at six years, Corn, 68. Wheat, 20. Malted barley, 12%. Yes. So it's a blend. So yeah. It's a blend through and through. So I think um, the 94% of the whiskey that's in there was sourced from somewhere else. And 6% uh, of it was actually from Bartstown. Bartstown. So. Yeah. But I mean, like, like I said, you know, I've, I've heard so many great things about this bottle. Oh, you know what I heard, though? To please like and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> all right so yeah so th this one uh we procured from uh santee market and liquor thank you frank um we i mean i i don't know where i've seen this at Dude. ever because it's always sold out if mm -hmm. we even hear about it so yeah. thank you for uh getting this bottle for us that's pretty cool you pretty know those awesome. incense sticks mm -hmm. i could fall asleep smelling this <laughs> yeah if i can get like those little incense sticks, you know, that smells like this. Oh, I would God. light that up every day. Oh. That is just. <laughs> that smells. My mouth's already watering, oh, man. bro. It's, it's, it's that good. That smells good. That smells really, really, really good. Mm. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I guess that's where the, the older whiskey comes from. I mean, the, the, the liquid is pretty dark. Um, I don't know if any, uh, you know, whoever's watching has seen the the color of mm -hmm. the whiskey in there, but it that that's pretty dark stuff yeah. in there. Now this is not finished in anything, right? It's just a blend. No, I don't think it's finished in anything at all. It tastes like it's finished in like a different kind of barrel. No, Kentucky straight. No whiskey. It's, yeah, you're um, right. It's it's yeah. a straight up just a blend. But this blend though that smells is really good. Just just the taste. Go ahead. Try the yeah. taste. I already had my taste and it's yeah. fire. On the nose, you know, you got the all the regular stuff the, yeah. the brown the, sugar, brown caramel, caramel, vanilla. Uh, got some cherry in there, I think. Yeah, I got the cherry. It's like very fruity. Very, yeah. very fruity. Some red red fruits. It reminds me of the sagamore. Yeah. 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 Remember the sagamore that we reviewed? Was, that that, that, that one. <laughs> yeah, you did. <laughs> <laughs> Bottle kill. Bottle sagamore. kill. Wow. Wait, where is it? Right here. Whoop. Yeah, he killed it. It was only a little bit left, though. He killed it. That was it. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, guys, uh, the smell is fantastic. I, I have nothing remotely bad to say about it. The taste, though, Lou, what do you get on that taste? Don't be shy. Just go ahead and let it go. Damn. Mm-hmm. Yep. The taste itself. Mm. That finish, that finish is it's smooth. Oh, I'm getting that, that. That tastes so good. I'm getting that fruitiness. Mm -hmm. I'm getting the chocolate. I'm getting the oats. Mm, there's something else I'm trying to find. It's there. That's good. That's oh, real dude. good. It's missing something. It's well for me, for me, not from the ribbon itself, but it's missing. Um, I'm missing a, a certain ingredient that I'm getting out of it that I, I, I'm trying to pinpoint it, but I can't. You're talking about like a toffee? Yeah, like a burnt caramel. Yeah, yeah. I, I'm okay with that too, man. That's it's it's it is fabulous. It's great. I have no issues against it. This. this is a really, really Disco good eleven? Thing. Hell yeah. We passed. <laughs> yeah. Passed the test. Um it's, I, I, there's a flavor that I can't hit. It's there, I can taste it, but I I can't figure it out. I can't On the palate. On the palate, yeah. Mm. What is that flavor? It's 
so good. But I can't pinpoint it because I'm, I'm getting hit by all the other flavors at the same time. I like the way how um, punchy it is. Very it's not punchy. overly punchy. No, no, no. It's, 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 it's smooth yet punchy, which is fantastic. And you can never... taste the age. You can mm. definitely taste the age. Now, is this something that's available everywhere? Because you bought this. I, I, didn't, I didn't. No, no, no. no, no. It's not. I okay. mean, it, it, it is, but it's, I mean, One of those it's, secondary it's so things. popular that, you know, it's gone. Mm. It's gone. Or, right. Whenever, you know, wherever you try to find it, it's gone. And if you do find it, it's probably a little bit more expensive. Hopefully, y'all can find like some place that, you know, does have it that likes you. <laughs> so you won't, you won't find it at Total Wine, then, is what you're saying. Yeah. yeah no. No, because I, I, I know Barstown, there's a lot of Barstown yeah. at Total Wine, just not yeah, this one. Before, uh, like a little while back, like, I think I saw this at Total Wine one day. Really? But I, I knew uh -huh. nothing about Bardstown and the Disco series and all this stuff. And I think I saw it there and I skipped on it because I was like, oh, where is the buffalo? Where? <laughs> <laughs> Looking for something else. Yeah. yeah something else. That's good. probably really, really good. But so. I'm glad we did get this one. This one is a banger. This it, one's it is. Good. It is. I, yeah. I'm still trying to find that damn flavor. That keeps poking out at me. I just can't <laughs> pinpoint it. That's the only problem I'm gonna kill this. Mm. It's a it's a fruit. I just can't it's kind of like stone fruit type of thing. No, or? it's just it's this fruit that I can't hit. All I know is man. But it's good. It's really good. I mean I'm gonna finish I'm gonna say yeah. that this is definitely a seven and a half eight. It's really good. It's great. I'm giving it like eight and a half nine. That that's pretty good. Oh, that's too like, much. No, it's right up there. Like I mean, like the the stuff that we think about, like C nine two three Elijah. I'll I give mean, it an that, eight. That's up there. I'll give it an eight, and that is amazing. It's it's an amazing drink, guys. It's it really is good. Um. Oh boy, I know it's not the same thing, but it is one hundred percent not the same thing. <laughs> but I mean, just for pure enjoyment factor. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, let's let's see. This is the Elijah Craig. C923 coming in at what's the proof, Luke? It is 133. <laughs> 133. Oh boy. What's this one? 118. 118. So quite a bit. I don't think that the bar sounds gonna beat the Elijah Craig on this one. I don't. I don't think so. Like, uh, I mean, like, who knows? But I'm not trying to see if it beats it. I'm just trying to see for the enjoyment factor. Mm -hmm. To see how um, much we might like Comes it, out. You know? all right? Because it, you know, that this is a thirteen. This is a mostly thirteen. Um, yeah, no, Elijah wins. Okay. Oh so, if this Elijah Craig C nine two three is a nine point oh, the uh, Bardstown Disco Discovery Series number 11. To give it a fair assessment, 9, 8.3. Okay. I'm okay with that because I gave it an 8. Yeah. So I, I can so right about 100 percent agree with it's, that. It's pretty delicious. It's yeah. The flavors on the uh, ECVP C923 mm -hmm. are uh, quite accentuated and it tastes. Well, I mean, for a 13 good. year, it better yeah, be. You very know. good. And this is like, you know, like what it says, it's mostly uh, 13 year. And the flavors are all there, but um, how we like the flavors, you know, it, yeah. it's a little bit more muted, but not at all. You no, know, obviously. No, not no, at no. All. It, and it, this, it's a different class. Yeah, it's a different it's, class. It's a different class, but. This one I'll give it an eight, which mm -hmm. is an amazing on the scoring yeah. list. It is amazing. It's it's delicious. It's great. If you can get it, get it. If you can get it, get it. Okay, that's all I gotta say about that. It's fantastic. Yeah, um, I, I can live with that. that oh, that's you good. had to say the f word. Freaking, <laughs> freakalicious. <laughs> anyway, that's that's a review for today. Please like and subscribe. My name is Roman. I'm Lou. Peace out. We're the Bourbon Beats. All right, check all later. <laughs>